how many minutes? 15 minutes, ready, go. <laughs> so we often like to watch videos from the Bible while we're eating breakfast and then we discuss it after we watch the videos. Therefore all things whatsoever you would that men should do to you, do ye even so to them. I find that that's a good way to start the day, thinking about a bigger picture, thinking about things beyond just the stresses of the day, um, but thinking about more eternal things. So in watching that clip, I realized how dirty our, my screens get. Gotta clean them off more often. I don't know if this is a good way to do it. watching SpaceX use their Falcon Heavy rocket to fly into space and then they landed all three of their engines back on the Earth, which is incredible. I know. It's really amazing the advances with space right now. It's fun to watch. So this is the image from the rockets as they come down. Here they are and they're gonna land. That is amazing. And then they have their center rocket comes down and lands in the middle of the ocean on a little boat. What an amazing day! That's where it landed. Yeah, like in the middle of the ocean. <laughs> Crazy, huh? I love these little quiet moments. They're so rare because life is just busy. Even right now, there's groceries all over the counter that I should be putting away. The frozen stuff and the refrigerator stuff is put away. But also, like, there's lots of stuff I should be doing to prep for our homeschool week next week or to prep for other stuff coming up. And I'm just... I'm just sitting here and enjoying this time as a family. Liberties for Sal by Robert McCloskey. Oh, this is a very old book. It was published in 1948. This book is older than Papa. <laughs> One day, little Sal went home. You guys are running fast, working hard. The thing I care about the most is them trying their hardest. It's a hard thing to do. It hurts to try your hardest. And it's hard to play against a big brother. <laughs> this part's got us two times. So Janae got the ball and started throwing it to us to start this game. Whoa! Good save. You wanna sit on it? Whoa! Uh oh. Whoa! Hey! I love that little girls like football. Now everybody's playing. Ooh! <laughs> Family football games are the best. Yeah! yeah. Great catch, Laura! Run, run, run! <laughs> Touchdown! All right, you guys, I showed this to Elise earlier, but I wanted you all to see it. 
This just happened yesterday. It did? Yeah. What? It's the Falcon Heavy. They took off into space. And then the coolest part, though, is that all three of its engines landed safely back on Earth. Wow. Do you see them? Yeah. So not only could they blow off, but they can land. And then their main engine in the middle lands out in the middle of a boat. I mean, you think of how hard it would be to have a rocket. How much do you think that thing weighs? Like so much. Tons like of pounds. Thousand, like maybe a, a whole ton. You remember we got to see a rocket when we were in California? Yeah, I think it was out of battery. It was out of battery, so it yeah. didn't work anymore? Yeah, I actually think they just didn't put any gas in it or something like uh -huh. that. <laughs> Okay, so anyway, that's hilarious. It was out of battery. So what I thought would be fun, you think of how hard it would be to land a rocket like that? With how heavy it is. How about us just trying to land eggs from the top of the stairs safely? So I'm gonna give you guys 15 minutes to design some kind of thing to put the eggs into so that they can land safely on the ground without cracking. How many minutes? 15 minutes, ready, go. I don't know what to do. Do you want me to help you? Yeah. That's your plan? Yeah, but I want to get stuff on the outside because I think if I can aim well enough, I can just toss it on. You're gonna just drop it on? Yeah. Do you want to try it right now? Sure. Okay, if you miss, you have to clean it up. I put it in a bag so then I don't have to clean my own mess up. Very wise. I did expect you to put a little more time into designing something, but if this will work, it's pretty cool. He's gonna give it a try. Three, two, one. Zero. Ignition. <laughs> well, it doesn't look like the bag held, so we're gonna have to clean that up. I know perfectly what to do. You know perfectly what to do? Tape a paper towel on it. Oh. So what do you think went wrong? Too small of a platform. If it landed on it, either way it would fall off. So I'm gonna make a big space that I can just toss it into and try to make it a bit more cushioned. Caleb found the tape. Lisa's going for the paper towels. This looks kind of like a rocket. Yeah, I'm gonna land it straight, hopefully. Put a towel in a bag. What else should we do to it? In it. More towels? Just one more. Okay. You done? So what's your idea, Caleb? What are you trying to do? Like a parachute. Kind of slow it down on its way down? Yeah, and then I might have a bit of cushion under it at the end. Alright, what are you planning on doing? So I'm going to drop the egg in here, and hopefully it won't touch. Kind of like a trampoline? Yeah. So here's Elise's, the egg tramp. All right, let's see if it works. Oh! You kind of followed Isaac's example by trying to drop it on something. All right, Laura's getting ready to go. You'll see what's inside here. Ready, set, go. <gasps> let's see. We gotta test it. All right, let's see. Hey, Laura, are you ready? Is it still good? Still good! <laughs> yeah. So instead of trying to drop it on something, she put it in something soft for it to land on. Mm -hmm. Good job, Laura! Thanks. And this is still lived pretty well. Oh, yeah. That was smart. I didn't even think of that. Yeah, you were thinking of throwing it on something yeah. instead of making something to keep it safe. Yeah, I decided to uh, put it in a lot more. How many bags? Eight. All right, and you're gonna drop it in here? Yeah. All right, let's see if it's gonna work. Right. Yes! Is it still it's good? good. Oh, nice. I threw it in, and it like hit here, and then like stayed I was right nervous there. it was gonna go through and land on the ground. Yeah. Good thing you bagged it a bunch, that was yeah. smart. I'm good job. Again. Elise has now developed a little spaceship of sorts. Is this your parachute? Yeah. I can't figure out how to get it on. Do we have a stapler? All right, Elise is going for it again with her spaceship. So you have a towel in there? All right, let's see if it works. 
All right, here's Elisa's second attempt. Let's see. All right, is it still good? Oh man. Oh man. There must have been too much pressure. Yeah, it probably won't work. It's just a parachute. We're gonna give it a try? And it took me so long. Yeah, I'll try. It has like nothing to protect it. And here comes Caleb, his first attempt to try to not let the egg fall. Okay, parachute Caleb. It did slow it down though a little bit. Maybe if we had a bigger bag, like maybe a Walmart bag on top. Okay, so Mark Rober has an egg drop video. Wanted to show the kids after their attempts. Mark Rober always goes into the science of it, which yeah. I love. He did a parachute as one of them. Yeah, See? but it didn't work for me. We needed to make a bigger parachute. Good night, get your house out. You just have so many kids, and you can just get stuff done speedy. That's yeah. why we had so many kids to get stuff done. Get stuff done and it's, it, it read my mind, and it was everything about me.